All right, the Ally 400 at Nashville Super Speedway, and that was a good watch. Um, is it the first one for NBC? It is, isn't it? And I can tell you what I liked about that broadcast. It was how it had some of the graphics that it did. Um, there were some bits, like where they were jumping to different people around the track, where the audio quality didn't hold up. But I liked the graphic that showed the kind of playoff tracker. It showed you the regular season points, um, as well as who had what wins and who was probably going to end up seeded where. I thought that was a really good thing to see. But should we talk about the racing a bit more? Chastain gets his first win of the season. First win in over a year, isn't it? First pole, I believe, too. Um, it's well done by him, and it was him versus Truex. A bit like it was at Dover a few weeks back. Truex, yeah, held on second. Went through his tyres a bit too early um, in that last run. What I found fascinating was in that top seven, you had three of the Hendrick cars and three of the uh, Gibbs cars. Because you had Hamlin, Bell and Truex. You had Larson, Elliott. That was a really good one from Chase Elliott. And uh, Byron, who had been running well throughout the night. And a fifth and a fourth for his, re for his return means for Chase Elliott that he's starting to climb back up and getting closer towards that cut line. Right now, though, he is 25th in points and uh, 16th in points is Daniel Suarez, who is currently, what, 100... Is it nearly 100 points clear? Hang on. Chase is on 289. Suarez is on 353. Okay. So, about 60, 70 points that he needs to find. But, yeah, not many cautions over the course of the race. One of the things that did stand out, though, was that crash that uh, Ryan Blaney had. That was off the nose of uh, Kyle Busch, wasn't it? And it was... Uh, surprising how violent it was but I think he was right there should be safer barriers on the inside um, and hopefully that'll be something the Nashville will work on that's where some people who had nice to forget Tyler Reddick running really well until the wheel came off it's credited with 30th place um, yeah it it was a race which went really well for some people the front runners especially but for others it was like eh, okay I think the fact that it was not necessarily underwhelming, but a lot more filler than we've had for some weeks this season was good. I think it's good to have the balance of the weird and wacky like we had at Kota, and then something like we've had this time. I said that last week with Snowbus, Snowbus to Kota. Anyways, those are my thoughts. Let me know yours in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye for now.